Thank you very much for continuing to watch um, Complexity Call of Duty and Call of Duty, and we promise you we're going to work super hard to get you a compelling team in the near future. Thanks. So one of the things we're working on right now uh, is figuring out Call of Duty. For those of you who might not follow Call of Duty, there is a, something called Roster Mania. It usually happens two, three, four times a year, depending on the seasons, where a lot of players rearrange who they're playing with and move to different organizations. You know, we've been having a, a, a great time working with um, Parasite and Study and fellow and dashy we didn't find the success with this combination that we were hoping for but they're really great guys however it's definitely time to look at new roster combinations see what people can come to the organization to get us into the league uh, and, and really just further our call of duty um, adventure i guess you could say so we're trying to sort that out and there are no easy answers it literally changes every five minutes who's playing with who who wants to come here who wants to go there who wants to buy this guy out who we want to buy out um it's a lot of action it's a lot of excitement i i'd, I'd like to say it's enjoyable but uh, it's not always enjoyable we'll get it all figured out and even if we don't feel the roster this time which i hope we do even if we don't uh we'll be back in call of duty eventually there's no rumors of other teams that are already in the league, maybe wanting to sell their rosters or cash out because they can't afford their team. The cost off was the only one, but you already squashed that rumor with him. Like some of these teams, I don't understand how they're paying 25 grand a month for Call of Duty and paying that bill. Yesterday, now the new patch is out, so everybody's playing COD today. Brand new game. I mean, I I just want to make sure guys don't get miss, you know, don't get hung out to dry. That no, we look after them, but we've got to keep them under contract till we figure out what we're oh, doing. Of course. So let them go ahead and, you know, tweet out that they can speak with other people and see what opportunities are out there. Do we want to spend up uh, upwards of 150 grand between now September. and September for roughly a top six at best team? With no following. No. I think I'm going to go back to Rick and say, hey, we're interested in your team. No, they no they're in the automatically. Oh, if you're in the league already. So they have, there's three events left. They have pool play at Seattle, pool play at Anaheim, guaranteed champs. And all of season two league. Well, yeah, and the league. See, if we can cut a deal with Chris to stick around because we like him, but got to be, you know, a shadow of where he's at. This four, for whatever reason, just wasn't getting the job done. I think they're all great players in their own right. It's like super hard to get you a compelling team in the near future. Thanks. Scott, what's your thoughts? Um, exactly what Jason said. We're, we're out of the game. It, it sucks. But we will be back, and there's a chance we're, we're back within 48 hours. Beef, your thoughts? Wish we hadn't made this announcement until the ink's all dry. <laughs> 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 it's really hard to negotiate when we just announced we're getting out of the game. <sighs> you know, I, I can certainly talk with Jason about this, um, and that f we can make a little bit of wiggle room, but we're not going to be able to go down to um, Would you be able to go to something like Okay. Cool. Yeah, let me know how it's going to go. Um, we want to make sure that Tyler's where he wants to be, but at the same time, there are, of course, costs that we've invested in him and costs that are going to be generated by having to pick up somebody new. So uh, I'm going to have to be pretty firm right there. Okay, yeah, let me know. Dashy, I mean, we hold his contract. There's interest from EG for sure. Um, NV, who knows yet? Blast, I mean, we're open to working with him. Um, so that's certainly an option. Aches and apathy is really interesting to me, and I can reach out to EG about that. Um, I, I highly doubt they are going to want to part ways with those two, and if they do, it's probably going to be prohibitively expensive, but I'll reach out to them about that. Um, so. Nothing else came up overnight. There's no other options. It's been quiet all night. It's super quiet all night. Apparently, TK. What about Theory? <coughs> Who's getting cut from EG? Not having Nameless. Just Nameless. 
enable Mike enable. getting cut. You know, if Phil hasn't gotten back from any pressure to get him last night at 9 p.m., then. Yeah, he can stay maybe around here and do content for us, maybe. And that's what he suggested. Yeah. yeah. He's like, I mean, if I can't get the right team, I don't even know if I want to compete the rest of the season. Maybe I can stay here with you guys, do some streaming, content, whatever you guys need me to do. You know, continue being part of this. Hello everyone, this is Jason Lake and I'm founder and CEO of Complexity Gaming. I'm back and wanted to give Call of Duty, our Call of Duty squad fans, an update on our situation. First and foremost, Dashi is staying as part of the family. Next, I get to announce the return of Ricky. Uh, return to the family as Ricky's been with us before. Super awesome guy, super great player. Welcome him back to Complexity. Next we have Blast who is going to be joining uh, with Ricky, thereby ensuring our league spot, which is super exciting for Complexity fans. And last but not least, we have Sensor of FaZe Clan fame. So this is our new lineup. You'll see them next at Seattle next weekend. We appreciate your continued support and ask you to keep supporting Coal of Duty. This is a, doesn't have to be a Picasso. Okay. Okay. I'll leave this on, let me know if it's gonna work. Okay. Oh, ooh, nice camera. Dude. I paid for that, man. <laughs> this camera? Yeah, I, I saw the oh, I saw the call. Yeah. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed watching a little bit of Roster Mania. I finally got to be a GM, so that was a lot of fun. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to give us a like. Of course, comment below. Hit that subscribe button and ring that bell. We'll see you next time for more POV.